extremely important, you know, not only for you know us seniors, but as well as the program, you know, just to know that we're still building the right steps. You know, we had a good season last year, but we're definitely not okay with just being eight and five. You know, we were capable of doing a lot better. We had guys stay here for 12 weeks of training over summer to prove that, and just individual work as well as group work with our positions just definitely paid off. And for sure, we're going to build off of last year. Just you know, so people definitely don't think it was just a one-time hit, and that we're not just you know a one-time year team, but we're actually building a program in the right direction. How do you build up last year? You know, there's always room for improvement. You know, people say we had a great season, but there's always room for improvement. You could do better. So, you know, this year we had a lot more meeting time in the summer individually, as well as, you know, with our position group. We watched a lot more film. We worked a lot harder in the weight room. You know, we met a lot more than we did last summer and just critiqued a lot of things that we could have changed to do better. So, if you talk about the line, and uh, you and Morgan in particular kind of anchoring that line and, and the pride you guys take in, in not wanting to pick the quarterback? Um, you know, to play offensive line, you you know, you got to be a different breed, I think. You know, just to want to, like, get down and really demolish somebody and really, you know, embrace your presence on them is, you know, is something you grow up being. So just to have me and Morgan, you know, anchoring the offensive line as well as, you know, Luke Boengo and, you know, Matt Mahalik, you know, Connor Davis, all these other guys. We've been working really hard all summer just, you know, to know that they share the same tenacity is, is crucial. What did you see this summer from Philip Sims? Um, not much, to be honest with you. You know, he's not in my position group. You know, I've seen him seven on seven. He looked great. You know, he competed just as well as Rocco and David. So, you know, I'm sure in camp will get the fair opportunity to compete just as well as they did. So I think that's any kind of a distraction to you, but kind of the quarterback starting job battle? Um, no, not really. I don't think it's actually a distraction at all. You know, Phil came in and Rocco and David embraced him. You know, they didn't look at him, you know, as, as a threat. They also, they looked at him as a way to compete, another competitor to get better and just critique their game.